red earring, red lipstick because we're going to be talking about rose water and I did not plan this at all. Hello beauties, welcome back to my channel. My name is Shweta Vijay and today we are going to be talking about rose water. Now I know I get a lot of questions. Is rose water really important? Is it essential? Is it needed in our skincare routine? It's been a very age old tradition, especially in our Indian skincare routines to have rose water. And growing up, I remember rose water was something that was extremely important in our skincare ritual to spritz, uh, you know, just to refresh in your skin for any of the Multani Miti masks that we were making, rose water was essential, including if at all we had an irritation in the eye, I kid you not. Uh, my mom used to put cold rose water basically in the fridge and just apply two or three drops in the eye and it just kind of like calms it down. So it basically it's all subjective, isn't it? It differs from person to person. Maybe on your skin, it is not actually required for a person who's got combination acne prone skin. Rose water has really helped just calm it down and soothe my skin for some strange reason. So if you have, I think, dry to normal skin type, then maybe rose water is not the one for you. It's filled with antioxidants, you guys, and it has got such great benefits, like it soothes irritated skin. And long ago, back in the day, basically, they used to use rose water uh, to treat redness, irritation, also infections. Back then, they used to treat it for conjunctivitis as well. So it makes complete sense why my mother was all for rose water, okay, and why I am as well. I know that there's a lot of rose water in the market today, there are so many out there, so many brands that add essential oils in their rose water, extra fragrance, okay? Basically perfume it uh, to a point that it really irritates the skin. So you got to be very careful when you're buying rose related products, rose oil, rose seed oil, or even, you know, I'm talking about rose water. You have to buy from a very good reputed brand. And I, after testing out so many rose waters, because I get sent so many products from various brands, but I've got these six beautiful rose waters, which I quickly want to take you through because hands down, eyes closed, you can reach out for this and you can be rest assured, it's not going to trouble your skin. The first one that I am putting in the list is this one from Shesha Ayurveda. This is the pure rose water and it's extremely gentle. It's pure rose water. They take so much of care um, and research in providing really good authentic stuff, okay? So I would trust this brand when it comes to their rose water. It has really perked up my skin. Leave it in the fridge. It comes in a glass bottle right now. Beautiful packaging, comes with a pump, a pump spray basically. Spritz it on the face, use it in the morning, use it at night. That's the best thing about the rose water. There is no timing to this. Even if you want to refresh in your makeup, you can definitely refresh in it with your rose water. Beautiful pro product from Shesha Ayurveda for less than 500. It's a wonderful product that has got no perfumes in it, okay? You just know rose water in its purest form. The second one to make it to the list is from Just Herbs. Again, a beautiful rose water, very, very mild. It's got that, you know, all these rose waters smells like rose water. It should never have that hit of rose water as if, you know, you're using it for your biryani or for some kheer, okay? That's not how it should be. I like the fact that this is also extremely subtle, very beautifully made rose water, very gentle, non-irritating, great, you know, with mask, uh, great without it. Highly recommend the Just Herbs one as well. The next one is from the brand Vilva, another brand that I love when it comes to their skincare product. I love the packaging also uh, of the Vilva product. This rose water, again, you can leave it in the fridge or I would, I would highly recommend you leaving your rose water in the fridge because it's something else when you spritz cold rose water on your face and the Vilva one is also incredibly subtle very very beautiful comes with a pump applicator pump spray in a you know steel kind of packaging and it's very very travel friendly at the same time and it's such a beautiful product it's more like a face mist I use the Vilva one more as a face toner a face mist every time I want to freshen it up and I use the Shesha as well as the Just Herb one um, and share a more okay that's also made it to the list 
uh, for my mask. And uh, the next one that made it to the list, of course, is from Cher Amour beautiful rose water i think uh, this is slowly creeping into everyone's personal favorites a lot of skincare bloggers a lot of bloggers in general is are using the share a more um, you know rose water it's very decent packaging again pump applicator spray very very subtle doesn't irritate the face and it's just a beauty of a rose water highly recommended the next one that made it to the list of course is what karma is known for karma ayurveda rose water is the best of the best you guys it's so incredibly beautiful um, but you know I really can't make a difference between Kama Ayurveda and Shesha Ayurveda really I just can't make the difference because both feel the same uh, fragrance wise texture wise everything the feel of it is just the same okay so it all depends on the brand that you want to love and support but a beauty of a rose water it is one of their best seller and rightfully so it is that incredible again some Something you can use on with your mask without the mask it just doesn't matter because it's just so wonderful and last saving the best for last is my all-time favorite you guys know what it is and that is juicy chemistries bulgarian rose water i feel the five rose water that i've given you tried and tested believe me uh this one is like a point percent more purer okay for some strange reason this has got a cult following i don't know why i keep going back again and again and again and i have introduced so many of my family members to the juicy chemistry bulgarian rose first thing that they say is i feel it's pure first of all it's got a very subtle extremely subtle hint now the five that i've shown you has got that very subtle hint of rose fragrance but this one has gone even more calmer okay even more milder and it's the that's the beauty of it okay it's a very mild rose water uh, which is superb for acne prone skin so if you're looking out for a very good toner or if you're looking out for a very good facial mist juicy chemistry is the one now juicy chemistry bulgarian rose water definitely you can apply it with your mask as well it goes very very well but i usually save this for refreshing my skin for perking up my skin before and after makeup it is that wonderful highly recommend this you guys and these are my top six favorite all-time rose water from india you buy any one of them and you're going to be a fan of it i can assure you so i hope you really enjoyed watching this video let me know what other quick top five top six top ten you would like me to do and i shall do it for you and i shall see you in my next and until later bye for now